There's a bad feedback a bad happening. Feedback Let's see. Happening. Um, are you hearing an are echo? Are you hearing an echo? I I'm, I'm hearing right right. Okay, let me like replug this. Do you do you hear me? Yeah. There. Yeah. Are you hearing that an echo? No, not on your side. But no, I'm, not on your for side, some reason I'm hearing an echo on my side. On my side. Let me see if. Let me see if resetting helps any. Yeah. Well, let's yeah. keep going. Well, I think it should, going. Be okay. it should be okay. For some reason, my some my, reason my own my voice is bouncing, voice but is bouncing. it's doable. It's doable. Okay. I'm I'm okay. using earphones. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So tell okay, me. So um, tell me. Um, tell me your thoughts about the program. Like, um, like, what do you see in this? Oh, man. Uh, so I, I love the program. I think it's a very good like bootstrap, uh, hands-on program, so you can like mm -hmm. enter mm -hmm. the the DIY um, Steam universe. Yeah. Um, yeah. I I have to tell you, I'm not I'm not a, like a pretty printing expert at, at all. I I I'm myself. Uh, Co-founder of a of a makerspace in Buenos Aires called mm -hmm. Neti, mm -hmm. meaning not everything is invented. Uh, and I have dealt with uh, like all kinds of. Sorry, say it again. Sorry, not say everything again. is not invented. Everything is invented. Not everything is invented. Name? Neti is 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 like it's a makerspace in Buenos Aires. I'm 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 a co-founder, but I'm not part of the board anymore. I I was there for the first two years and then I I left. I'm 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 still a, a stakeholder. I'm still a, a, a partner of the business, but I, I as I don't live anymore in Buenos Aires and I and I don't get along much with the with the rest of the the partners. I am I'm, I'm just like uh -huh. part, part of my past of my past. Tell but me, uh, do you have a link for that? Can I look that up? Can I look that up? The Neti, yeah, of course. It's Where's Neti Makerspace. I will I will send you. A, I will send you a link here. Uh, it's nowadays uh, as the country is not going very, not, it's not going well at all. Um, oh no, it's not going well. Okay. The, okay. The, um, it is. Uh, it is more focused on on software, uh, on, on soft skills uh, things like. Um, they are more into like. Um, Creative consultancy, uh, things like that. In You're talking about people at Natty. So, yeah, the 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 business model it, it it changes from being more like a a maker, a, a hardcore maker space. It, it mm -hmm. went into more like corporate mm -hmm. consulting on new technologies, uh, new methodologies. Like, uh, like I, I think that they do more. Design, um, creative design, and, and design thinking, and things like that, mm -hmm. rather than mm -hmm. than like building things with Arduino. Arduino, you know, like they mm -hmm. are more in that mm -hmm. vibe. I, I'm not part of the team anymore. At at, at one of five, I'm just like a founder, and I, I I hope they go well. But because it's my business too, in some point, but I don't. I'm not part of the community anymore. Is I, it because you you're because getting you're, more into the hands-on hands work? Hands -on work? I left my I left my country. I left. I left. Uh, I needed a change. I was tired of, of that business view. I didn't. We didn't share. You, you know when when you 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 know who you divorced from, not who you married to. <laughs> so we didn't get along with the with the partners, and I, I left, just left the the project there. So let, let me just close is the that because is that. I was going to ask, is the ask, is political the situation bad in uh, situation bad Argentina? In, uh, Argentina? Yeah, the situation in Argentina is going like hell, you know, like last last government did a lot of shit and, and we are like going through a very deep crisis that it's just starting, you know, when you when the, the plane starts to go wrong and you know like you have like 10 minutes before that before death <laughs> and we are like looking so fast we are going down but we cannot stop it yet it's like a, and we have elections and, and we are in the primaries so we are between elections and it's hell but well 
we are used to that like, the third world is like that you know like it, it, it's, it's, it's like uh, it's, it's not completely autonomous in terms of government it, it depends on many things happening in the first world so we are like trying to deal with it yeah i hope yeah. things change from this december on because it's about to change the government so i think they they will like protect a little more the and is, is is Brazil pretty is stable? Brazil is it good in Brazil? good in Brazil? So there are going changes. Every every country in, in Latin America, almost every country is going to the right right now. So yeah, yeah. So everything except Bolivia and Uruguay is going to to neoliberalism again. So it's getting very hard for for the the mainly for startups because the, you you start you you start having like lack of resources to develop your project not yeah, not to mention my project that is social that is that, that is nothing that it will bring lots of revenue in the short term so on um, culture project and education project that, that that everything is the first thing you will be like taken out of the of the sheet of the of the spreadsheet when it comes to to, to funding but uh, the whole region is, is going through a, a very deep crisis because it's it's we are in that in that um, we are part of that uh, the Cambridge analytics laboratory lab experimental like uh, uh, dystopia, you know, when mm. everything can be mm. handled through fake news and, and WhatsApp. Do you think? And, and do you think? Okay, the work that we do with the okay, open source microfactory steam camp, open source, open source product camp, development. Do you think any of that has relevance to fixing all that shit? Fixing all that shit. Of course it does. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, truly yeah. believe. I truly believe in that. My, yeah. My, as I as I yeah. told you, my project is based upon that same philosophy. I have been like reviewing your videos the last days, and and it has all sense for me, and and it it really uh, like inspire a lot of, 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 of uh, like the principles of design I use in my project. Tell me more about that. Tell me more about that. Let me actually. Let me actually. Yeah, I want to take a look at some else because I had some questions for you. For you, I want to cover. Um, I want to know first of all what is uh, what about OSC? Tell me more specifically. Uh, what what do you like about it? Which which part resonates with you most? Okay, uh, well, I, I, I'm a nerd and a chic and everything that has to do with taking thing, technical things with your hands is like just playing and, and, and keep playing with, with, with that. Uh, but um, I, I, I really believe that, that you, you need like the, the material resources, the, the, like the combo of, of technology, um, let's say uh, production medium yeah? uh, the production medium the knowledge uh, the the software layer that means like group organization and and and, 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 and like the, the, the way the, the, the human technology you know like the, the, the layer that allows yeah. to run everything and and, yeah. and and not to like kill each other between your friends when you're trying to do it and 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 I also like very, very, very much the part in which you are trying to make a, a sustainable business out of it, or at least like you have a branding layer, which I also have. Like branding layer. Branding layer. Yeah, yeah, the open source ecology brand. I, I, it, it's something that I had, I have been following for for years, and <laughs> and I have been like ups and downs, and and, and recoveries, and, and 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 evolutions, and 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 back to roots and things like that and I like it very very much and I have been inspired by that um, open source business model point of view in which you have you need to have a business model at least one or two or whatever and that could be like product selling or summer camps or, or workshops or like getting funding from persons or or NGOs or, or foundations or, or whatever 
and I, I have been like uh, you as well as Cameron Sinclair from Open Source Architecture as well as Dave from, from sorry Cam Cameron uh, Sinclair from where Sinclair from where Open Source Architecture okay the okay. guy from the UK the guy from the UK I think he's I know I yeah I think he okay he, open okay. source architecture open source though architecture he's got a TED talk he, he used to have a, 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 a the project like evolved in two or three stages now they have pivoted again uh, the open source architecture original project like what is closed and he, it's second evolution too but I, 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 I'm not like very worried about that because it, it means something it's like something that I take the snapshot of the of the proposal and I, I keep seeing how it evolves and, and, and the principles in which you have a community build, building up like um, products and documentation and, and, and processes and, and, and building like business models and, and sustain, sustainability models and, and, and community building and everything as well as this is plastic model as well as some other like let's say open desk uh, business model like uh, enterprises I have been following that like really shows me how you can create social value and make and make a living at the same time and, 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 and have a lot of fun like I think that triangulation is quite like the key for this to, to oh, happen oh. And, and I admire a lot of, of your work because you have been there for for a bunch of years I think like yeah. it's almost a decade like yeah. since yeah. You, you you bought your your, your ranch and, and you started with everything and I really like like the things where they are going right now and, and I think it's 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 a, a reference a model I had to to keep seeing. So I I would I would love to like get in, in in touch with all that like universe in which like a much more ambitious project that, that I have. Like I my, my vertical is education. I want to to get very low low cost didactic toys to the to the masses and it's very specific yours is much wider and, and ambitious and, and, and even in, in business uh, point in a business point of view but I, ha I think it has all to do one thing with the other and I, I really I really love to, to keep like diving into that methodology ecosystem like trying to, to give what I know like to share and, and, and to learn a lot in the in the in the in the meantime. What what do you, th what, what do you th think about your think ability about to your learn? Because the, 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 the program that we're trying, program to, present we're trying to present is ambitious. Is ambitious. I, didn't, I, I didn't understand your, your question. Hmm. Hmm. I'm asking. I'm yeah. asking. See. How are you unlearning? How are you unlearning? Part of it is part of it is part of the attraction to people is it's a learning community. A learning we're creating community. a learning, we're creating community. learning community, right? Because right, because in developing in the developing Steam the camps, camps, all of us will have to learn. Will have to learn. Like for example, like I've never example, built the electric, electric motor that's in the motor, curriculum, curriculum, but we're going to find somebody that did. You know. Yeah. Uh, so we're going to be uh, so gonna having be to learn from each other. How do you like that part? Can you do it? Can you do it? So I was I was telling you I'm not I'm not a like a 3D printer uh, specialist I don't I, I I'm not the best like designer for 3D printer or 3D printer builder or or programmer or, or things like that I have like 3D printer lots of things but I, it's not my specialty I, if I if you if you ask me with a, a, a pair of beers in, in with me I will ask I will tell you I don't like 3D printing or so, or something radical like that because it's like still for my point of view like quite expensive slow and everything but they really what really goes behind that is that it's not I what I have to say about it is not the right tool for the environment I live in like this decade in this in this social uh, reality in the, in, in Latin America I, I prefer other kind of tools like CNC's or laser cutters which I like handle with a, a little more like quite a lot of lot more precision and and, all, and and experience and I know what I'm doing when I when I get one of those machines 
and I like very much this kind of product that you take like a sheet of, of, of plywood and you have like a design that you, you, you take all the pieces out of, of, a, of a like laser cutter or, or, or CNC milled and you break it apart and you build it and you have like one PDF machine in, 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 in it builds straightforward and that kind, kind of thing I'm really passionate about and that's the kind of like I have a tensegrity kit. Uh, we developed like as a as a modular robot, parametric robot, modular tensegrity robot, um, steam product that we it's still in beta. But that's the kind of product we we try to develop and we try to encourage community to participate on on, on development. And um, I I'm, a, I'm an electronic technician. I deal with like Arduinos and, and, and programming and everything. I'm not a crack and uh, I'm not a hacker at that. I'm not I'm not a, a genius from 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 making Arduino or 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 electronics or whatever. But I can learn and I can like get something that is like kind of well documented or, or standardized. Get the thing and, and produce it. They're like like share it. I I'm quite good at, at technical facilitation. I, I explain difficult things to pe to people that is are not so familiar with technology. That's my every like I do that since I was a kid and I have been doing it for the like almost forever since I I, I started doing things like that and I keep. I still do that. My my project is about like sharing technologies, like packaging something comp complicated and, and complex, like like is a maker point of view, and trying to reduce it to like some small piece that you can share with other and share a, 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 a little a, a big universe with a less amount of molecules possible. You know, like and an experience and a point of view and a way of thinking. And I really like like that thing about the about the 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 steam camp because it's very evident how you like start with something you connect it with other thing you connect it with other thing and you have like the four pillars for building up upon that the, the um, to build a lot of other things upon that and i really like the the, the i'm very curious about that 3D printed motors. I don't know how you end up doing it, and I'm really curious at that because when I was at school, I I, I built my own prototype motors, and I and I it was like two decades ago. But I'm I'm, I'm still trying to understand how you do that in the modern 3D printing era, and I think it's a very like it's very important important for us to get the, the production media like uh, like we have our own resources to build our own pieces for everything just in case like zombie or drone apocalypse is our right. and <laughs> we we really we we really should like take back our 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 like hands-on technology so we are not just users but we can like make the things we need or at least not be so dependent on Amazon or China or whatever supplier you you are used to so I, yeah, I, man. I love yeah, the man. whole I love the whole the whole concept I was re just checking my US visa I have still two other years of, of Oh wow. US, oh wow! US visa, business business class, so I I'm eager to use it. <laughs> so let's okay. tell me how, okay. how I can help. So a couple of things. So, so you don't think we could run one of these in Brazil? What? You think we can run one of these in Brazil? I I I don't I don't think I understand. Oh, can we oh, can we run one of these run events of these in, Brazil? in Brazil? Or people or don't have money? People don't have money. Okay, so it's it's quite a challenge. I I really need to understand which the the profile of your of your usual uh, participants and and intention. Things in in Latin America in terms of of maker movement are quite like cold, still cold. My business Netty was very difficult. To, to start up like four years, five years ago, and it's still very difficult. That's the, the reason we it didn't it, it, it didn't got a very good even point yet. It was it's like very hard 
to be in a recessive economy in, in with other other like social political and economical urgencies and to try to get people to get involved and focus in that uh, exponential technology universe not not much people is aware of what we are talking about when we when we say take back the do-it-yourself uh, tools and, 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 and build a new society. They, they, it's really, really, really different, difficult for people to understand what this kind of, this kind of, of thinking model and working model, community working mo model ne it means and, and how it works and, and what, how long how we, can we get from that. And there are certain folklores in Brazil for like getting people together and 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 do things with them, and there are like certain paradigms that are quite difficult, even for me, which which I'm, I have li been living here for for four years, and I am from Latin America too. It's difficult to understand, so I really need for to give you an answer. I really need to understand better like the the intention the profile like the costs that like there's a lot of things that we we should understand previous to give an answer to that yeah yeah are you supporting are you yourself supporting from the work, from the work on the structures the, the work how do you support yourself, you right, support now? yourself right now so we at the Alchemetricals we have a four four um pillars sustainability model in which uh, product selling is is one of the um, is one of the pillars uh, workshops education we are focused on the education so workshops are our our main um, workshops and, and product uh, attached to, to workshops you know like are, are the main uh, sustainability resources then I have been like quite uh, successful in getting some money from like grants or residencies or like um, you know support from some organizations and prizes and things like that mixing from time to time from like stepping de depending on who is looking I present myself as, as an artist as an educator as a, as a maker or, as, or, or an ONG you know like I, I it, it, it's kind of, of versatile and flexible, so we use that triangulation to take to speak about education, arts, and, and, and technology, everything together. And um, the fourth, the fourth uh, way in which we have been trying to support ourselves is crowdfunding. It hasn't been like so effective because it needs some certain skills and dedication. We didn't have right now but w to solve that we are like launching a, a, a community call in which like we are asking um, people to like be part of the project and like um, it's a it's a, a very ambitious community uh, interaction model um, in which we try to crowdsource everything, and I, I am very, um, I, I have a lot of faith in that, in that uh, like step we are giving right now. Um, I'm, what's I different would, about what's it? Different you about just it? haven't done it you before. Haven't done it before. Regarding the Regarding sourcing the from, from the community. The community. I, I didn't know that. Excuse me. Is the community part? Is the community part different? different? You're saying you have a lot You're of hope in it. Hope What's in different? It. Different. The thing is, I I think the what is making the difference is that after we got that MIT Media Lab Fellowship and that Gosh. Um, and Creative Commons invitation and that's in Red Bull Station, Red Bull Basement, Hacker Residency uh, things started to be like more, we, we gain a, a little more recognition from community because it's kind of different, difficult to, s to sell this idea to people that are quite like conservative in their point of view if you're not like in some kind of hype, you know, if you're not kind yeah. of famous, people yeah. it, it, 
it's quite difficult for people to to trust and as I was telling you I, I'm not you I don't have like your resources or, or even like capacity so it's it's uh, quite challenging in a, in a, um, when you are like nobody to explain uh, uh, the, 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 the market or the or the stakeholders that you have a proposal that have like a, dif a differential value that will make really it will that it will it, it has so building cases for the past three years more is easier because we have gained more momentum. Um, it was quite relevant. I have spent the last the past uh, three months in Europe. I have uh, I, I I went to Spain, Portugal, and and, Mar and Morocco to like give workshops and share the experiences and and make some residencies and and like network with the with the European fab lab and universities and collective contraculture permaculture community and it was like much 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 easy to explain to people what I was doing what would what was our vision why we were doing it how it was easy to like be part of and, and how is value how is value involved in the in the in the in the community building and and I think that next year will be quite different because we are gaining a lot of support from from portugal and and spain um, fab labs and, and university and communities and designers um, communities so and we just went to two like low europe uh, countries i have been never to, I have never been to Germany or Netherlands or Belgium or things like that that invest uh, much heavier on education and, so and social impact. So we are quite positive in the in the in the path that we needed to gain some some volume before people start taking us serious. You know, like and it, I think it's happening and it we as much time as we devote to like. Um, looking for fun, not only for funding, but support from institutions and, and making partnerships and things like that. It repays. It, it really gains like support, and the project is going higher and higher. It, we have that transition. It's difficult to to move from one person, one like, like the 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 self, the self, the, the one man band to to a community and. We are really community in terms that more than 50 people contribute, but they are very, very fragmented contributions because everybody here is like have, has like two or three or, or four works, jobs, so they can live. And it's like they are, they are doing it because they love the project or me or, to, or, or both. But it's like we are trying to get some, some contributions from <laughs> European uh, like people with a little more like resource and, and, and spare time to, so they can contribute more freely, you know? Yeah. Um, yeah. Tell, me really about what, tell me about what I want to ask you, I wanna ask in, you your right in your now, work how, right now. How has OSE how influenced, how you, you work? influenced how you do your work? You said you, you said you, how taking, what? excuse me? Open source ecology. Open how, source ecology how, how have our ideas, have our ideas influenced, what, influenced you do? what you do? Like in your design. Like in your design. So uh, you're, you're talking uh, how open source uh, ecology have influenced the archimetricals. Are you talking about that yeah. or my shop yeah. in general? So I, I share that the view that like uh, for instance knowledge should be free that, like that, that that's a very philosophical and, 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 and technical and economical principle i share and that's that's the main the, the roots for everything because I, I i have seen it as you always say about like the linux industry or the open source software uh, and architecture model it, how it changes everything in the in the world wide web yeah. world yeah. and and how uh, we can all benefit just for sharing. That what something else happening that one plus one. You know, when you when you share, something else is happening. You, 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 I have seen it real time with, with when I went to to Europe. Like, it's not just about taking some cold knowledge and 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 re 
releasing it in a cold warehouse. It's like people getting together, bonding, uh, exchanging not, not only experiences but uh, dreams, needs, uh, expectations, fun, you know, like there's a lot. I, I could be like producing spare toys. I could be making pieces for people to make, like build things and have a, a, a limited experiences regarding using. And I do, I'm not interested in that. I mean, I'm interested in sharing knowledge in the in the in the way and and empowering people with like knowledge about materials, knowledge about tooling, knowledge about uh, the ways we. Uh, share the the, 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 the the models so we, we the, the different ways in which we can adopt that technology and the, uh, and, and adapting the local technological and previous knowledge we had so it's not about just the product it's about the experience uh, of the sharing and and I think that's something more than relevant in in, in, in the open source ecology that like the community and the, and the intention of building a, upon a, a community conscious, uh, um, conscience and, and, and conscious, you know, consciousness. It's like, I think that is more, is more, let's say your, your tractor isn't efficient, isn't, isn't, is worthless, but you have learned so much in the process, not only about tractors, but about how you like need to, uh, manage your warehouse, your people, your, your your diet, everything to make it work. That it makes all the difference, and that's why that tractor designs are not only based on uh, efficiency or market price tag or whatever, but it also is designed for humans and to be able to be produced by humans, not just by robots. So that makes a complete like a foundation for a new society construction the, the 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 way actual real people interact in the in the in the construction of the new rules and the new tools that needs to be like that society for to be work it's not like technocracy it's like technophilia or like it's philosophy and technology together being doing something for good actual good yeah human centric yeah, technology, technology technology that might even help you grow even help you grow that that yeah and 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 the impact that like your personal your your personal um, experience and 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 point of view will will apport will add to the project even though you may not be so technical skilled but there's something on your presence being part of the process that will change everything and will like influence the whole process and the whole results of the of the product. So yeah. I I'm yeah. I'm a believer in that in that in that sense and I really think we should be doing this at a very higher scale. And I I have been looking for uh, spaces where to develop this philosophies and, and to learn from these technologies and methodologies and, and, and way of, of like administrating everything, and and I'm I'm really really happy we are we are speaking right now. I, I think it's it's kind of a journey until I got here. Yeah. So you're yeah. talking about so social, talking production, about social production, production, like, like open source micro factories micro and communities. Factories in communities. Well, I, I told you one of my my influences uh, was was Dave Hackings from from. Um, Precious plastic project. I'm actually very critical in a, in a technical uh, scale of, of Dave's project. I think it's, it's quite far from efficient or, or, or viable. It, it, it still needs a way to run before it, it is actual uh, feasible. But the 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 um, fractal proposal in which you have like micro units diversified all around the world in each like lots of them in each garage in each neighborhood that makes a lot of sense a lot of sense to have like small units local small units running um, with local um, available materials with local um, feasible machinery 
with uh, uh, like taking advantage of local tradition. Perhaps you have like some some uh, blessed community that still know how to make a shoe or still know how to fish or how to make a boat or thing, or some things like that. And I respect. I mean, I I I'm part of a of an of like a family that comes from that. You know, my my grandmother used to sew my, and, and to knit. My 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 grandfather was a, a, um, a naval carpenter, so he used to like build boats and and repair them. Yeah. And my yeah. and my brother, he's a, a a rocket engineer. So there's something there that is actually connected in 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 taking the tools and doing things, and 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 we are quite proud of that. And I, I, Alchimetricos itself is a way for transferring all that heritage in the smallest, as, as I told you, the smallest amount of molecules possible and time, you know, like this, there's a 20 minute um, entry barrier in which a, a girl, a seven year old girl, and, and arrives telling, what are you doing? I don't know what you're doing. I would like to play with you. Okay, let me show you. And I spend 20 minutes with, that, with her. And when another identical girl appears 20 minutes later, saying, "I don't know what you're doing. Uh, I want to play with you," the first girl says, "Let me show you." And that that system in which we can replicate in 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 that like geometry uh, geometrical scale is like my passion and 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 a, and a, bel a, a belief of what like modern communications and and and, and technologies and, and 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 the whole point of view of our era is is capable to and we we can do a lot of change in very little time if if we use the quote the the actual human technology you know, yeah you know, yeah the, yeah, the, the, the yeah. so organization. so let's talk about the let's the curriculum itself, the curriculum itself. So, what, so what in in the idea is that the we need to develop, need to develop it. it. A lot of it. Lot we have, of prior, it. We art. have prior art. If you look at the. You look at the not sure if you look sure at the look prior, prior art. Prior art so, let's see, can you look at my screen or you're on a cell phone? I'm looking at you right now. Are you on a cell phone or are, are you on a, a computer? I'm in, the, I'm in a tablet. I... Tablet. Uh, why don't we, uh, why don't we take, a look at this, take a look at my screen? Take a look at my screen. Uh, let's go uh, to, let's go to curriculum. curriculum. So if you, I don't okay. know how much you studied, but, much you but studied, we have to go through the day, through day through one through four, in, one detail through four in detail and see what, and see what, what you would be able to help us develop because we're, we're making the road together. We're gathering a team we're that gathering all of us are going to make this happen. Right. And then, right. And then, so there's a diagram of kind of like how it works. But open source prior art, so that's what we have to, to build on, universal access, CNC circum, all this other stuff that's prior art that either we have done or other people have done or are building on it. But the question to you would be, what do you think you can, you can tackle there as far as something that you can do to help develop the curriculum? Because we don't have all the curriculum yet. The idea here is we're going to develop it for the first event. the first event and after the first event the first we're going to keep improving, keep improving it. it but for the first one for the, the first, first event would be, the hardest. would be the hardest and it requires, and it requires some, some heavy lifting, lifting from people, people to, to, actually happen. to actually make it happen yeah i mean we've got a lot yeah, of pieces all, but it all needs to be all needs it needs to work it needs to to be made presentable, be made presentable really, high quality. really high quality we need some work we need some work like for example we haven't i haven't built the 3d printed motor but other people have, other right? People have, so, right? so we need to either, so find, either them or, find them or, or develop it or ourselves develop it if we cannot find anybody, find anybody that, that is willing to work willing with us. To work with things, things like that. Things like that. Yeah. Does that make sense? Does that make sense? Uh, no, no, it, it makes completely sense. And I want to be completely uh, like sincere with you. I, 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 I'm not a uh, so skilled pro product developer. So I can tell you, hey, leave the leave that motor with me. I will I will develop it and mm -hmm. I will mm -hmm. calculate it and and prototype it and and document it and it will be ready in like 30, 30 days time. I I cannot I cannot guarantee something that like that would would, would work. 
I'm, I'm pretty sure I can get something that is already documented and tested and I can reproduce it and I can help a lot in, in transferring it to a crowd that is not so familiar with the techniques. I yeah. can really yeah. do that. I can help thinking and experimenting and, and putting my hands on that. I don't know how efficient I can, I can be at it because I'm not optimized for those kind of tasks. Lately, I have I, I, I run another kind of, 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 of technology demanding business. Mm -hmm. that is, mm -hmm. I'm low, a, a much more low tech. Um, it's, it's not so high tech centered. My my business is more yeah, about so you're good on the you're good on the teaching yeah, side. Share, teaching yeah, yeah, and I, I and I focus a lot in the base of the pyramid. I, lo I, I mainly focus on people that know nothing about technology. And I, I am optimized for the first degree, for the first barrier. I, I work with the with the, the minimum possible barrier to enter a world of of, of do it yourself and and and, and digit, not digital prototyping, a start analogical. I, I use those those punch hole pliers like as it, it was my toothbrush, uh, you know, like on an everyday basis and yeah. I start yeah. with that tool and I eventually, if things go very well, I end up like explaining people how you can laser cast, but I start using that punch my punch hole plier and I enter the, the world of scalable, scalability, um, parametrical design, and, and digital fabrication from a completely analogical and, and all, all like a caveman's journey, you know. And and I want I don't want to promise you I can be in a level in, in which I cannot guarantee because I, I, I don't want to mess. I I really want to help and 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 I really really would like to be part of in a way that is functional is good for you is good for people is good for for me and, and my project yeah yeah i think that I think probably, that probably once we develop more of this we can involve you on the teaching side. Teaching side in the meantime, in the meantime you can, you can look at, look at I, don't I don't know if you can look into look more detail into, more into the, detail curriculum into the curriculum itself and, and see if there see is anything there you is can help us develop because we need, you know, if you don't see it in the prior art, art, we have to develop it. Like there's some very there's specific very things that we're building that during, we're during the workshop, during the camp. Yeah, of um, course. I, I really like to understand which is the profile, which is the type of public you are looking for. Yeah, yeah. Well, the kind of people that have been attending is, I mean, it's, in these workshops, it's definitely kind of like the permaculture, the computer programmer, all the progressives, like the, the outliers of society. It's not mainstream people. There are some mainstream people like like Republican businessmen that come, that see the promise of enterprise that can come out of it. But mostly it's but mostly the, very it's the very progressive, like, like okay, okay, if I could name, one, I could person, name one person, it's the, it's the computer, computer programmer, programmer that wants hands-on hands skills, hands skills and is attracted is to the vision. Okay, the completely, the completely, the completely digital guy. Yeah, yeah. That that would be yeah, like the number like one the number profile. One profile. Okay. Half of your people is that is that kind of. Uh, but that's not the but right that's thing. Not the right that's kind of you can say that's the people that fund it. But but our target, our target audience, audience, which which we haven't attracted, we haven't so, attracted much so much because we don't have the business have side, the business well, side well, developed, well developed. But I've seen it but in the last work, last, last Steam, Steam camp. camp. I've seen, I've seen three, people, three people, three or four people that can definitely take maybe even like five or six that are considering doing this as an enterprise. So, or at least so, got, at least got, they are entrepreneurial they are already. Entrepreneurial so we're starting already, to, so we're to starting attract to the more entrepreneurial, entrepreneurial types. types. Um, um, the eventual goal the eventual is goal people is who people want to be producers, want to be producers, whether it's, whether it's, well, it's the well, social it's production the social producers, production producer. people who want to start people a micro factory in their community. In their community. Yeah. Are, are, you, one question, are you getting these kind of people like one by one or are you like, Harvesting from some kind of, 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 of 
pool organization. No, or, I mean, we, no, just, we post just post the events online, the events online and, people and people show up. Like, show for, example, up. for example, we have a build have a of the CEB microhouse micro house in Belize, and I post, Belize, that, and I post that, and people are registered. People are registered. Yeah. It's all over the internet. It's all over the internet. Yeah, I understand. Because yeah. I think there are some focal pools you can like. Such as? Uh, Such as? Dive into. I have been quite interested in, in the Erasmus um, grants pro program in, in Europe, in which you have lots of, of 20 year old students trying to make their, their own business with this old school uh, or like ultra capitalist uh, point of view, but they are not thought uh, like how you can engage the power of the commons and things like that. And right. I have like right. experienced some some boot camps with, with this kind of groups and the fact is the interest part is interesting part is that you will have to deal with the European Union partnership with some university or some or things like, like that for the payment and the 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 clusters of people will be much much more like similar among each other because it's, it's, it's a kind of student that is building startup I will, and you will end up like evangelizing uh, a certain profile that it more it is it's something that is more clustering uh, um, well, tell me specifically. So, what are you referring? So, where are you, referring are you suggesting we should, uh, you suggesting we should look at uh, what what pool of people? What, what pool of people? Where? Uh, I, I don't understand. Excuse no, me. I'm saying. What? Can you be no, specific on your suggestion? So, who are you suggesting? Who are you suggesting? We should reach out to. We should reach out to. Yeah, because you you need cert, certain mindset for for your to accelerate your the community. Yeah. should have yeah. certain uh, like entrepreneur profile to like get the thing with with their own hands and 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 so you're suggest so you're, you're suggesting suggest this thing called erasmus this thing called erasmus I suggest that erasmus should be looked out as a as a uh, scalable and and formalized and 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 uh, yeah, it's, it's, you, you, you will like be able to get clusters of, of people with similar conditions. Okay, but tell me, okay, I'm, I'm kind of lost here. here. Tell me what Erasmus, tell me is. Erasmus is. Erasmus is a program from European Union for, for supporting education development for certain strategic areas and it's deeply connected and, or committed with, with COMAS with uh, like um, it, they are quite committed with with ODS you know, like sustainable development objective and 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 it's something you can build up a, a proposal and and end up selling with no much difficult to a lot of universities with they are already have the Erasmus money available and they need something to put their people on and it would be like wonderful to make a partnership between uh, like some fab lab in Europe mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. like get your content and your proposal and your methodology like a like a camp uh, bootcamp and put it like fetch it uh, to like Extremadura in, in Spain get some people and some funding from Erasmus and and press play and, and execute um, in, in different um, locations and, 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 and institutions and everything and you end up like building some kind of aligned army of, of people trained in your in your technology and methodology and, 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 and point of view philosophical point of view which is self payable I, I really believe that's possible I have been looking I haven't seen it in, 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 in work. I, 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 I met some co-working spaces and permaculture spaces that were getting some Erasmus funding for getting some Erasmus grantees and, and making workshops with them, camps, and, and it really worked for everybody. So that's a kind of, of 
of thing that it, it, it really work. And some partnership with, with Precious Plastic will work too. Like, uh, I really think of um, running some, some pilot programs with like Spanish or, or Portugal people. I really believe that can work. Uh, yeah, you are like very ODS friendly. Your project takes into account a lot of, of um, sustainable, de de sustainable development uh, objectives, and there is a lot of. You have you have Erasmus funding for things in Africa, for example. Like there are a lot of Tanzanian fab labs that are being uh, funded from European Union's uh, programs, for example, Nigeria, Nigerian programs that are like going very fast because they got some some funding from from the Netherlands, for example. And, and so I are, think are that's you thinking the kind we of would, opportunities. We would, we would basically we would say, basically okay, so work say, with okay, some okay, Fab Lab, some, some lab, collaborator. collaborator. And what do we and do? Are we, do we basically do? Are we basically running the program there? Because I mean, I can't be there? everywhere. We need I mean, to train people, right? Train so people. how would we? How would we yeah, yeah, this? that's, that's what we... I'm talking about. Uh, I I think you need you need a, 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 to to gain some. You need to gain people. You need to that people to be able to pay for themselves or somebody to pay for their for their participation or paying for everything that is involved and you need to spread the word and you really need to make some partnership with other kinds of organizations that have similar or complementary points of yeah. views. Yeah. What do you think the revenue model would look like? Model. So what are some of the numbers there? Could that be a scalable mm, model? A scalable model? Yeah, yeah, that, that's what I'm, I'm talking about. I think that's not a bullet time uh, one, one, one one time shot i think this is something you can execute one time after the other in each city mm -hmm. every, mm -hmm. every six months you know like mm -hmm. i really believe mm -hmm. that that's the kind of thing that can be done and apart from erasmus there are a lot of, of other other um sources of fin financial development for that this kind of things and i um, so i'm not a, a management so expert but i really saw that as a as a very promising source of, of getting like funding so for let's see so maybe let's something see. like maybe something like we get funding to get train, funding, a person. train a person it should be that we it should be that we we pay the person, pay the person to, person get, to trained get trained and after that they can after basically after run, they the can run the events themselves yeah i i'm not thinking about persons but I, I I like target organizations because it, it, they are like more used to organizing things and you yeah. need certain yeah. skills and experiences and, and structure. You need some background and, and infrastructure and, and agility and, and uh -huh. so so maybe uh -huh. I should try so, that with so Fab Lab Prado. Oh sorry, Fab the Media Lab oh, Prado. Sorry, the Media Lab Prado. Okay. You know though? Have you have you, you know though? Yeah, yeah, I, I know. I yeah, I've I just, I just yeah, been just, there just been in there, June, so June, should maybe so bring it up to them. Should maybe bring it up to them. You you should really send something to them. I I, I think they would buy it because that's the kind of thing they are looking at, and I and, and they are they are looking at uh, looking for projects that are not just using Spain or yeah, Prado as a as a showcase, but that something really impacts in the local community and, and I think this is the kind of thing that uh, could make an impact perhaps not in the center of the city but if you like partner with some uh, peripheral organizations um, Media Lab Prado has that problem which is a very cosmopolitan uh, space that ends up being quite snob you know and I have been like very uh, successful more in the periphery because things are people are much more grateful and, and respectful for your for your work because not they are not getting so many projects visiting them mm. and they mm. end up valuing a lot and doing a lot of much effort for you to be there that because they, they can you can you maybe list maybe some, organizations list some organizations that we can work that with can I don't know I mean I don't okay so I, 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 I would really I would really put you through the Vulca project, do you know them? No. 
No. Vulca Project is something quite interesting. It's some kind of network. It's a collective of people trying to network every fab lab in the European Union and oh. trying to oh. uh, make some lobby um, upon the European Union just for fab lab mobility funding. So this is the kind of, of clustering structure you need to partner with because you, they have a 250 database of, of, of fab labs in Europe. I have had access when I when I went to Europe, I I met the the people and they told me, well, tell me where are you going? I will help you contact people. And I showed them which was my ex my expected route, and they start me start sending me contacts from Fab Labs, and I ended up working with three of them. So it, it was very effective because in three weeks time I was like partnering with three different Fab Labs because they they introduced me. And, and that's the power of the network. And they, they are trying to make that kind of, of, of service uh, a, a business model. But I think in the, in the actual, yeah, in, in the certain partnership model, you can, like, both of you can, can have a revenue. There. Yeah, please send me yeah, that information on that, that, that organization. I don't know about that. Yeah, well. yeah. Uh, it's bookclub.eu. What's in here? I think this is it. Let me check it. Mobility program. Mobility program. Yeah. Holy yeah, cow. That's the that, Holy cow. That they the focus and and they have that's that's the they the capital. They have two hundred and fifty contacts, actual real life contacts in Europe updated. And that was I was trying to tell you about. They, this is was for me, it was a wonderful experience, not only because I, I didn't have the contacts and uh, ended up having and, and ended up building, you know, like executing workshops. It was like to see, it was wonderful to see how Fab Lab uh, managers were eager to invite me and, and was like paying for my trip and, and, and paying for my, my they, they were hosting me in the, in the, in the, in the wide uh, meaning of the word and, and, and they were happy I was there and, and they had me a lot and there was a lot of love involved and they were passionate in, in like it really it's really eager to, to collaborate community in, in, a, in a wide spectrum so I, I, now, I think that now, mining, mining that that capital is even more important that that like funding or, or, or or even the technical stuff. You you put together people that are eager to do things together. It's like very powerful. Poland direct contact. Direct contact. Direct contact. See, um, um, this is cool. Yeah. This is cool. Yeah. Um, um, now, Fab now, Labs are. Fab labs so this is for Fab Labs. This is for Fab Labs. <laughs> or. Or. So Fab Labs have already the old infrastructure you need to like build all the seeds you need to, to like keep on developing products and, and they already have the community engagement, they already have infrastructure, they already have um, organizing workshop, uh, training, they, they, they already have like half of the of the needs you you, you have for for building yeah, like for executing your, your plans, they are already there. You don't have to explain much what you are doing to that kind of people. So it is a, a global platform that is ready to plug and play. That's why, like, Bulk is, is so interesting for you to get a, 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 a partnership. And there are other, like, rational organizations among among Fab Labs are, and, and makerspaces and, and, and not only um, technical uh, Fab Labs, you, you, there's like 1,000 and 200 permaculture villages in Brazil. You know, there's a, a, a blog in which you can find a list of them, and you can partner with the like clusters of permaculture communities. Like one month ago, there was a meeting in Galicia that was like people from like 80 communities, permaculture communities in Spain, were getting together once a year just to discuss permaculture. And if you go and are part of that events, you will be like showing up for a lot of, of, of potential, but not spare people, like collectives. I think that, that the net, networking networks is, is, is much more powerful and effective than targeted, like standalone uh, 
uh, funds and, and and not be like I think there's some kind of pro of problem in in the for example uh, the precious plastic community it is like full of outsiders it's, it's full of like ghost Instagram accounts of people with no engineering engineering or, or making knowledge trying to like build up their first shredder or injection or whatever and it's like some kind of bluff you know like it's not actually effective or efficient to have so many people from with no background trying to enter the game and it is wonderful as a movement but it's not effective and and and, and i prefer dealing with communities that are already engaged you know like people that are not know what their actual uh, rural or, or, or urban or, or suburban realities are. They, are, they are, they have the means, they have the experience and they have the, the, the commitment to make it work. Yeah, yeah. Do you know any specific person, person at Volca? So I, I, I will, I will uh, make some contact with that kind of, of um, permaculture or uh, regional events like there's a, a Spanish network of permaculture uh, I, I don't remember right now the, the name of the institution but I can send you the link my friends in Galicia were part of the were, were wanting to go and, and know the organizers and they are like some kind everybody knows each other in that kind of network so it's not difficult to to get there in Argentina there's a very very uh, uh, powerful permaculture network too and and it's it's, it's a space it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a vertical in which you will find a lot of, of, of skilled people that will uh, rapidly be able to adopt your proposals and uh, they are quite efficient in many ways and and, and I, I think that may, mapping that kind of of, of pools would be like a, a mayor like it, it's a good investment you know like you will repay because you are dealing with pros you are, you are dealing with committed people and know know what what they are doing and i respect and i value that a lot yeah i mean maybe yeah, you can, I mean, maybe can, you can you help me help find help any find people any that are potential that are teachers for steam camps for steam out camp, of these people so people who have tech people have ability, ability to do to develop some of the technology and, technology and be good teachers can you so can I you recommend any yeah, people? I was I was thinking of, of that quite a lot because you have the good ones that are always busy. Yeah, I have been reviewing your, in, your invitation letters and lots of people said I'm, that's wonderful. I cannot do it because I'm very busy. Yeah. yeah. And and I started to like I ask it every day if I know one pe one person or other that makes this or that in the technical. Scale and, and could like give a workshop or, or everything. I know good, good makers, but perhaps they have a son or a daughter or a family and cannot go to like Missouri for two weeks or, or drop. Well, no, but the idea is the idea is that's local. Locally, that's local. We, we do it. No, we distribute it across the world. You want it? You want it to distribute it? Okay. So I really partner again with a with a fab lab pool team and I like for example in in Lisbon you have like four three three four maker spaces in Lisbon yep. and you yep. can make a distributed like they, they speak each other in a quite smooth way so you can make something distributed in which look you, you make one machine in each fab lab or you get one one teacher from each fab lab and they work all together and you make a, a Lisbon camp in which you engage for fab labs or maker spaces, um, communities and workshops and, 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 and everything and teams working together and that will, that will be like much more near of what you need than taking one people from one side and another sandal owner from other and putting everything together. Yeah. As I was telling you, they are almost ready to go. They are. They have the tools. They have the knowledge. They have the community. They have the the, the organizing training uh, experiences. 
they have some they have housing they have yeah, but I mean, it still depends on individuals running those programs, right? So and the revenue model has to work out so it's sustainable. That's why we're saying, okay, here's a, a, an instructor, we're training an instructor. So it'd have to be someone at the at the Fab Lab or at one of the hacker spaces that takes it on and who owns that project. Otherwise, it never gets done and there's stuff that needs to get done. That's why I, I was talking about this kind of, of organizations that are already have something that is paying for the bills. They have their own spaces and they, they, you, that everything is given, for instance. Some, for example, in this one, you have a Fabla Benfica, which is in the, in the, in the sub, like it, it's, it's, it's located at the university. So they already have the salaries paid. Yeah, but how do you motivate them to, to take extra work to develop the program? They have to be entrepreneurs. In, in, in getting new contents and, and engaging in new, in new network, they are especially, I, I'm talking about them especially because they are my tutors in the project. And I know them quite well. And yeah, I, introduce and me. They, yeah, of course I, I will. And and they and they are part of of Creative Commons Portugal, and yeah. they are yeah. linked with the university, which is an an, an education and a teachers teach, teaching university. Yeah. And they are related yeah. to the DMP, which is um, an European Union network for for open source designers, and they are connected what is it to called? Wiki what Factory. Is it called? ddmp.eu uh, Let me... Can you send a link? Market uh, platform It's distributed design.eu So as, as you can see, I have been more, like last years, I have been more devoted, not because I, I think it's funny, but it, because it was in the need of the project, to be more in the like networking and the management rather than in the workshop, like dealing with like tech stuff, you know, like I have been more uh, in building partnerships and uh, trying to understand how to develop the model independently of, of how myself can solve the, the actual technical stuff. So if you tell me how I can contribute, I think I, I, I'm more useful in this kind of brainstorming. Uh, right, yeah, like, I, I think yeah, you could be most useful in connecting me to specific people that can, that can absorb the, uh, the steam can program into their facility or into their work yeah and i i'm a, i'm always like kind of obsessed with scalability of this kind of thing so when i think of who to to contact and which uh, budgets to try i to shoot i i i think of something that can be replicated or can be like okay okay recyclable but but i mean uh, i think the answer is there if the program is well developed then a person then can, take, a person that, can that, take that, you know, it's nine so days for the nine camp, for the maybe a few days to prepare, days to so you're talking about two weeks. about two weeks, so that enables, so that enables if that makes money, then they can get paid by that, and then they have a half-time job that pays all their bills, so that's got to be sustainable. Of course, of course it is, I'm, I'm sure it is, I'm, I, I really see the, 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 the value opportunity, and like the multi-layer value opportunity, there is something called fluxonomy in 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 like the orange uh, economy uh, side of the world, like the sharing economy. What is the philosophy called, called um, fluxonomy? Fluxonomy. Fluxonomy or fluxonomy, which was developed by a Brazilian by a Brazilian woman. Uh, speaking of like really really social involved financial point of views and she speaks about four four dimensions of, of economy which are uh, economical environmental social and politic and i really believe in that for the uh, point of view of the world and i really see oh. how it oh. applies to to your Lala da Frenzen? Yeah, yeah, she's quite a, a very interesting person because she's an artist and she has a very human approach and he's, she's kind of, of 
humorous and, and very charismatic, so it is, she's very effective in transmitting its, its power. And she's a very, like, a leader. A lot of people uh, really um, support her and, and believe in what she proposes. So she's, she's a, 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 a not formal, she's not an academic or sharing economy author. She's very practical and empirical and, 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 and she has been around for a lot of years. So I really respect and, and, and have some, some uh, like, admiration for, for her work. And I, I know her in, in, I have been working with her one time or two. And I know very close, we, we are, we have some very close people in common, like my ex-girlfriend or things like that. And, and I really believe that partnering that kind of, of collectives and organizations uh, is like something when you arrive, you have already a lot of things done or, or, or like can add a lot of value. She's a consultant too. So, uh, and she works for some companies, so it is like, possible to make some kind of partnership. Uh, oh, this is, a, where is she from? Where is she from? She's from, from Brazil, she lives in Sao Paulo. From Brazil? From Brazil? Yeah. Yeah. Huh. Huh. Okay, so I saw okay, something so about saw product something development. About she said, well, we got to talk to her. Uh, can you contact, connect, me contact, me connect me to her? Or? Do you? Yeah, of course. Yeah. I, 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 will, I should, like, say her, I say to her what, explain her what are your, like, the, expect, the expectations. You should review her, her work and, pro and proposal and, and, and make, like, I can do the connection right now, but I, 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 would, uh, I should tell her, hi, la la, there's this... American guy trying to make this wonderful new technology society project and I think Tuxonomy can add some value to that and let's say let's see how we can like take some shoes of out of those oranges. I I I, I, I know a people or two that can help in that in that area too because I I'm, I'm have been researching the sharing economy for some years. And I'm, I'm my best friend in Argentina. She has a, a, a news. Uh, she has a, a portal of, of news about sharing economics. A specialist that in uh, some kind of saban in, in uh, meaning what's happening uh, in the sharing economy world. Um, in, in sorry. Um, so she knows a lot of people, she has lots of connections and understands what's happening in many spaces from like maker movement to biotechnology. She's also a consultant for, uh, in communication for uh, what's her name? Uh, Open uh, City. What's her name? She's Marcela Bash. I sent you, she has just sent you her, her uh, news portal. So she's something very, she's very a very useful point hub of information as well as some guy in Barcelona from we share we who knows a lot of about open who is that model. who is that uh, he's Thomas uh, oh. Albert, Albert okay can you write that down okay, can you write that down yeah I don't know how to write his last name I would search here but that's the kind of people that would very would, would be very helpful helpful very helpful as, as collector. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. That's that's yeah, why I'm talking, that's to, that's you. Why I'm talking <laughs> to you. Albert 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 Okay, but but, okay, but look at the elephant in the room here. here. At the end of the day, it means what it products means what product are, registered are registered on the Oshawa site, site as being side open, side hardware. open hardware. Isn't that the case? Isn't that the case? Yeah, of course. So, so why am I why am, am I seeing any products? Seeing any products? So, for example, like okay, so example, the person, like. Person, uh, like, uh, like like Lala, like for example. Lala. So is she actually so involved in projects, projects with develop open source hardware products? 
she's not she's not from the hardware background she's my, more much more conceptual okay, um, okay. yeah she has another scope she's more like conceptual but it, that that in, in globes that in technology and, and how hardware actually is one layer of the of what she's talking about mm -hmm. and I think mm -hmm. that uh, what is more rich um, is to have like diversity in the kind of players that are part of the of the yeah. Uh, yeah. of the pool so you have some people from soft skill universe mixing with technology people with mixing with like permaculture people and from institutions that you know like you need some bureaucracy surfers too so y y I think that gathering everything together is the key for not being just like an island, a technology island, because this is for the people, so you need like to engage community in a, in a very like... Right, I'm saying right. that the main I'm missing piece, main right, piece now, right now... Well, well, I used to say the main missing piece was technology, but I, I, right now I switched it to say that collaborative literacy is the main missing piece. But collaborative literacy is important insofar as it leads to a reality, and that is called open source hardware economies. Right? Yeah, of course, but you have to package it for humans to be understood. Yeah, you know, you need... Yeah. People yeah. from all from all paradigm to to get the new the new update and and there I think that were that's where Lala's words are, are key because she has the skill to introduce the human layer of the thing mm -hmm. in a very like mm -hmm. practical and, 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 and funny way and I don't think you should just work the, the Lala's procedure but it, it is it, like helpful to see from that kind of glasses to to her glasses. How to focus the um, the human approach yeah. and institutional yeah. and the institutional partnership, you know? Because you can, I have saw, I have seen some some co-workings partnering together in Portugal to get some some Erasmus students grantees and making a bootstrap uh, bootcamp uh, weekend, so they teach a, 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 a variety of soft of hard and soft skills. So they can develop their social project or or or, or capital based project in a in a new way. And this this joint between technology and and uh, sharing economy perspective is something so integrated and complementary that I think that will be a, a, a very um, very effective program to offer to many organizations. I think there are a lot of organizations l looking for programs with such potential and, and, and silos, you know, like complementary things and, and practical things, group dynamics, you know, things in which you engage your body, it's, just, it's not just listening to a PowerPoint uh, presentation, it's like engaging it in the way you cook Every everyone together when you role play uh, financial situations and you and you like try to reproduce how you will get that that knowledge and take it to your village and make it work. That's what that's why I was thinking when you s told me will you organize something like that in, in Brazil or do you, do you think that it would work? If you partner this the actual the 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 the, the, the certain the, the right people, it would work very well, and if you don't focus it very well, it will be a completely failure because there's a lot of 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 path of, of way to be what between where we are now in terms of mainstream philosophy of how technology and and the start and, and entrepreneurship. Um, values are and, and where we think, I think we share a view, and, and where we could be or we should be walking to. I, I think that most of the people in Brazil are, are walking in the, in the wrong direction right now, that's my belief. I, I, and I'm tired of explaining 200 million people how wrong they are. <laughs> but I think that there's a lot, there, there are certain verticals in which there are some possibilities to generate some awareness and you, you need to partner the actual 
the institutions to do that. And, and my, my yesterday deadline was about that, like entering uh, uh, some kind of incubation program in which I can like develop my network and, and be like um, supported from some mentors who can help me get the right connections and it's all about that I think that getting the there's a lot of, of resource around to support your activities you have to change to channel it and, and that's a bureaucracy surfing skill that you should be looking for the, the, the right people to, to occupy those slots so they do that hard work that is doing the institutional and, and human layer of the of the of the work mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. the RP too like I haven't I have seen in, in, in a lot of, of wonderful updated pages in your wiki and, and, and a lot of, of the events uh, that, that should be like at least like should be minimal upgrades to be like much to show much more um, like uh, and life pulls and, and depending on where you land when you make a search about open source ecology you end up arriving to very updated and evolved places and you may be seeing a very old and update, old, um, like um, like update um, part of the project and you may lose interest because there are a lot of dead projects in, in, in this in this area in this scenario <laughs> totally open source open source architecture doesn't work anymore but and they have been quite important for a while so um i probably like to 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 know where i can be helpful i i i would like i would be delighted to be part of the of the program in, in any way i would be glad to go to missouri and live the, to live there for a while so i can like share the tech and and the, and the methodology experience and, and to like make a great upgrade and, and in my in my resources and like to 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 share my knowledge and my experience and my my point of view in, in and, and my products too because they are already there so i i really love to 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 see how we can do something together really i i more interested in this at this time not to take any responsibility to make something in brazil but to go to a source and get, into, get connected with everything that is happening there and 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 breathe it real time and um, and then i i think i will be much more uh, available or or, or 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 empowered to be to make something that is more locally diversified yeah yeah that sounds good in the meantime, so we got to have a product, so we got to so develop the product, get people enlisted and then helping to develop it in the meantime. So in the meantime, if you can, you know, make the introductions to some of the people you mentioned. Of course. And that'll be a good start. Count on that and let me know where you you need some some support i i can tell you what i have in, at hand and i what i can like help you with i'm i'm very, very glad to to help and and um i'm and perhaps I'm, I'm i'm quite sorry i cannot help you with the with the hardcore stuff you, you need right now which is the the product development the actual product development and uh, I will review one, one more time the um, yeah the, the curriculum the, the, the syllabus curriculum. the curriculum so I can like say well here is something I can I can get and and, and, and do or, 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 or contribute um, I I I don't feel like taking the responsibility of, of saying this is my I, I will leave this this unit because I I'm not like 
I don't feel I have the engineering proficiency you need right now. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. I can I can be quite effective in, in transmitting and, and to share it once once it is, is uh, like prototyped and defined and, 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 and developed. Yeah. And, yeah. And I can be quite useful in this layer of thinking together, getting some contacts and some kind of conceptual consultancy. Yeah. 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 You mentioned yeah. the word C level. You mentioned the word C level. Is that what you said? So, meaning that curriculum level? Meaning curriculum level? No, I, 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 no. I didn't see that. I didn't see that. But it sounds cool. <laughs> I thought no, you said I, something I, like C level for at the, at the level of the curriculum. Level of but okay. Curriculum. Okay. No, no. The, the, no, it was. I don't know, oh, maybe you're just saying to see, oh, to see, to see well, to see, to see level in a good way. Yeah, yeah, see, 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 to see the review, to to see what I can help with. And um, apart from that, I I would like you to to ask for a fast like a feedback on what you saw about talking magicals and what did it, and what did you see, what what did you like. What was your impression when you, when you did you open the the web links I, I sent you or, or anything? Did you see something? Oh, like what's that? oh what's regarding your work? Regarding I thought work, the thing yeah, that attracted me was that you're me was talking me. about empowering about average empowering just people average off the street, off the street, just totally breaking through the barriers of skill level and access because that's what we do we show that people can build themselves and build their own world so i said okay this is a guy that is doing the same thing as we are okay thank you i i yeah i'm 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 trying to do it with like minimal resources. That's, yeah, that's yeah. That was that was the impressive was, part that, that you know you're not working with a lot, but you're a lot, but you're appears like you're appears succeeding like you're and getting people really getting engaged people really and engaged. getting recognized and for getting that recognized by all the residencies. All the residencies. So that looked pretty good to that me. Pretty good to me. Yeah, that's that's actually working. You know, I have been giving some workshops in some cities uh, around Argentina and, and Brazil and. And there is something that is happening that, are, that, that, that quite a lot of people are, are adopting our technologies and, and reproducing them. And there is a, a, a kind of autonomous alchemetrical community that is starting to grow among mainly educators and makers. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. it, is, it, it is like validating our scal scalability hypothesis, our viral a potential hypothesis in which we transfer a minimal amount of, of knowledge and that knowledge uh, it's uh, like almost everything you need to like continue the, the work and we have this very simple concept in which our brand this this little piece of, of, of this little connector we use, you know, that that hexagon with with holes. Mm -hmm. It's our branding. It's, it's, it's our logo, and it's the template for the for the for the product too. It's like the Coca the Coke brought the instruction sets in it in, in the bottle, you know, the, the recipe in the bottle, and that is quite powerful. People have some kind of bright in the eye when you when they understand the idea, and and when you say. Hey, this is the, the technical content, it is free, you can share it. This is the methodology and, and didactic guide, yeah, like the collateral, collateral materials, they are also free and shareable. And this is the branding model and the business model, and it is also free. And you can use my brand, and you can hack it, and you can do whatever you want if you, if you, if you are able to. So oh, you're, we, oh, you're, you're open you're brand open too, brand so you, <laughs> that's yeah, the first well, I heard. Yeah, so you yeah, let yeah. other so you people, let use, people the use the brand as well? Yeah, yeah, and it, it, I have been impressed in the way they, how the people that have been like, reprodu have been reproducing Archimedicals have been very careful and loving with the, with the, with the brand itself and the, and the project and respectful for the, for the citation of the of the origin of the project, uh, like not very formally, but they they have been very like kind in the way they have been like passing the the, the, huh. the knowledge to the rest huh. of the world. And I have been I have been receiving photos from 
random people saying, hey, this is an archimetrical construction. And from time to time, it is actually somebody I have trained that have trained another people that have trained another people mm. in the fourth line, in the fourth degree of connection, end up <laughs> in a workshop at a school and then, and I find in Instagram something something hashtag with archimetricals yeah. and I, yeah. I know nobody related to the thing, you know, like this is like popping out. Yeah. And that, that's yeah. the concept of seed, you know, the, the something you, you give to other people that can put in, the, in a certain terrain and it grows. And it's really working and I need support to scale it because it's really working. Yeah. Well, yeah. congratulations well, on the open right, brand. That's the first brand. I ever first heard of that actually, that pretty, actually much. pretty much. Good job. Good so, job. Thank you very much. There's a, there's a blog from a guy in, I think it's, he's in France, which is like bold and open. I will send you the link. Yeah. He's specialized yeah. In, in, in open brand projects. Open brand open projects. Brand wow, brand that's a new one. I've never. Open, open, open and bold. Huh. Huh. <laughs> that's good. Because that's the kind of, 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 of guy that would be really interested in making an interview to you and give you some, some press and perhaps reaching some audiences, you know, that I, I think that's, that's quite a, a, a bridge you should like be trying to, to build. Yeah, I mean, I'm all into yeah, learning, I'm so, into you know, See if we could maybe get connected. All over learning. All over learning. When are you planning to make the next camp? Probably four months. Probably four three months. months. Four months, three maybe. Four months. They are Missouri. No, all no. over the world. All over the world. Okay, you are not trying to make the next the next camp there. No, I, uh, but no, actually, I, I will run, I probably will, will run that will when, run that because, because all of us have to run it. I will, yeah, I will yeah, run that, yeah, but it will happen, happen in six to twelve locations worldwide. worldwide. Yeah, but will you be like prototyping the thing in your local? Yeah, okay. Yeah. You need something yeah. like that yes. to like yes. and, and wrap up everything. I will, the I will. Part, read, you, can read, you can read more about that if you see the link at the bottom of the curriculum. Yeah. It has a link, it has a link which, is called which is called Steam Camp Candidates. Steam Camp Under Candidates. that it shows the process, of, shows onboarding. The process of onboarding. So there's a so point there's six, a it's preparation. Point six it's preparation. So, so Part of it is that we we Part have to verify that the technology works, technology right? So works, so I need to I need I to see that people need to send that to me, and then I need to produce kits for the whole thing. The kits will be like three hundred dollars to build the build like all that thing you see in the curriculum. It's about three hundred dollars in materials. So we have to ship that out across the world because people will submit that. We co we collaborate on doing that. And then we everybody has to get a copy of that, and then I will uh, get a copy of ship. Depending on how many people sign up for the workshops, I would have to ship it to the instructors. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. where I, I I say you should be getting funding from not spare people, but from some organization that are used to like spending money in in content and are looking for packages of of like lots of, of um, programs that are, re that are ready to go and, and you should be offering to, to that kind of organizations with a certain amount of, of negotiation you should be up and running in, in some month time you know it, but you need to partner with the, lo with the actual like beneficiary some institutions like fab labs or co-workings or, or or academic institutions are more used to hosting that kind of, of content okay. and okay. should uh, yeah there's another there's link another at the bottom of the bottom steam of camp candidates steam camp it's candidates. the business model the business model uh if you can uh, work out some of the numbers for that numbers i mean we have the numbers have worked numbers out i mean just a basic business model for how, how the economics work here. work here that would be a completely that different a model completely different not completely model, but i mean uh, but i mean, have to re rework have that. To rework that but if you have any suggestions, uh, yeah, on, that, suggestions I, on that i mean the, the bottom line is that 
that the tuition is, the tuition is I mean, revenue I mean, for revenue per, workshop. per workshop. So basically, it, so works, basically it, works it works out. If 12 people show 12 up, people show up uh, the, revenue uh, the revenue share is about, share I mean, is about total, costs total costs are about 9,000 9, bucks for the, event, for the event and revenue is about and 18 or 19,000. So there's about 5,000 on 5,000 revenue share between the between instructor the and the OSC. For doing all the work. So I mean the numbers are I mean, pretty numbers high there. Pretty I mean high there. what we do with the do fab with labs the and others, fab and we have to work out a new economic model for them, but so we have to rework all these numbers. Uh, I could take a look yeah, at that. I'll take a look at that. Yeah, I will re review it later, but I, I, I there's something I, I can like smell from here is that that should work for like when you have a standardized can uh, yeah. process. Yeah. Well it sounds and, like, and well, it like in a development stage in which you need like some ceiling capital to develop the whole thing. So that's where I, I really insist that you should be getting some funding from other from other sources before expecting for actual spare people to pay for the for the what it called actually costs. Because it's really to develop things, new hmm. things is quite expensive and doing it in this analogic way is an, an even more expensive. And, and time consuming. So you really need some initial capital. So I'm not saying you don't have because you have a lot of a lot of infrastructure already there. But and, and everything. But it is you. You have to like uh, your our accountancy should consider like twice, twice or three times that that's excellent before it works, you know, because it, it, it needs a lot of, of, of trial and error before it will like be able to tune it up and, and make it link. So well, it actually, no, no, I, I will stop no, you there. Stop it's not, because this not business because model is simply an extension model, of the revenue model that we tested that about two months ago here. This is an extension. We've already done this. Extension. We've already done this. Uh, so the last event... Uh, so the last event we had 18k in revenue and after all the costs there was we some money left but it was a lot of cost for development cost and, development. and materials and all of that so based on those learnings there i came up with these so new numbers so that's that's already there, there. the missing link that's is there. some, there. Of, the some of the curriculum addition yeah so those numbers are not numbers i didn't pull them out of anywhere that's actually based on the last event yeah Maybe I should yeah. make that more clear. Yeah. Maybe I should make well, I, I will review it later and yeah, give you my, my feedback. Yeah. From my experience, yeah. the first of anything is always expensive as hell because you have to, to, to take it out of your head and that's... Like well, yeah. Well, yeah. That, yeah. Was that was the first one last time, so this one is less expensive. Less expensive. No, and I understand your, your product library is like the machinery library is getting thicker and thicker and you have like more and more available designs to like uh, almost ready to go and you put it in your pipeline the curriculum and, and it should be you, sh you should arrive in an instance in which you take everything from a from a already available uh, like folder and you put it there and it works but until you get there i think that's quite a development process anyway i as I told you, I'm available in, in, in I, I'm quite mm, demanded from, from Archimedes because I need to do a lot of things every day, but I really like to help and I really like to go there and, and, and like think of some kind of partnership in which I collaborate from with, with what I know how to do, which is like transferring knowledge and, and, and designing processes or, 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 or models or, 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 or programs uh, in the integral in the organic way and and I think that I can help in the in the like not high end technical not bureaucracy in the middle like in the in the middle water like speaking to technical as well as financial as well as, as, as RP or, or thinking strat strategies for how to like scale and, and, and have more reach in a, in a globally because I, I think you have already done the, 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 the first the, the, um, the let's say the, the heavy part which is making the, the project to be alive for the first 10 years and so I, I really believe you have like 
and everything you need to make an impact on like very very large impact globally. So I I expect we can find a way we can partner, we can contribute. I, I really like to go to 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 get to know the the, the, the branch, the space, the, the, the people that works with you, the, the whole infrastructure. Um, and the database. I, I, I was looking for the, the wiki trying to, to find where you have your like CNC models and things like that. I don't know if you are already have public repositories for those kind of of, of machines. Uh, I was trying to share with a friend who's Yeah, it's all on the wiki. Yeah, the the place you, you need to go to is OSC part library. Ah, that's the link I was I was missing. Can you tell me what yeah. for me? Yeah. I'm here, just text me when you when you I when you have any any idea of what I can be helping with. I yeah. I be yeah. I will be reviewing that curriculum and trying to think how I can help and I will be writing down some, some names in the list. So I can show you around and, and start introducing emails or making some calls so people, strategic people, get to know you and vice versa. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Sounds okay. good. Sounds, Sounds good. good. Sounds good. So we'll be in touch. So we'll be in touch. And let's see what, and let's what see. can happen. Yeah, of course. So, Marcin, it was a pleasure to meet you. As I told you, I've done okay. a lot of your okay. work. I, I, I really that I can be speaking with you and, and making a, a, a little contribution. And let's keep in touch. Yeah, yeah, excellent. Excellent. So thanks for your time. Like we'll we'll, be, we'll good, be in touch. Good we'll luck with that candidate's researching. Yeah, yeah. thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.